Hello and plenty thank you for watching the Koina Dugo and Falaba TV News. My name is Abdul Mansaye. Today date is Sunday the 28th January 2024. And today program, as we all get the sad news inside Koina Dugo and Falaba about one lady where they see inside water, a dead one, and uh, we don't get the lady in picture. And uh, this is not the lady. And same way so, um, the next picture is yes, this now outside and go see um, inside the water. And uh, they'd already pull out of the water, they don't care and go to the hospital. We get this news here, but we're not going to just come and give them information where we're not starting. So we get for wait for police and other authorities then. So of recent, we see the police them um, share updates. Now we WhatsApp group and people them we not able to understand, not able to read. They ask me for a little break and down for them so then we're able to understand. The same way, so we get for get interview with um, the late lady we want to see at the screen. We get for get interview with him brother, we himself get for the part of the program. Well, according to what the police then share to the general public, they say they see one woman we get Boku wound them, they see her in die one. Well, they continue for read waiting the police then right inside Creon. And as you see another scream. Um they say one thirty-five years old woman we they see in that one na one water na kamase um, inside Kabala Township, and uh, the police they may respond to the call we then call them, then go there with um, the investigation department CID um, from the Kabala Police. We lead them by the crime officer, detective, assistant, superintendent, police, D slash ASP, Mr. Mohamed um, Feka. We then visit the scene. We then go to the scene. Um, they see one woman with the inside water in Taiwan. And they don't pull the woman. They don't care and go to the Kabbalah government hospital. Well, uh, the police then discover this body and then come find out, say, now one 35 years old woman we named Aiba Barry. And um, he floats now the water half naked. He gets wound them na in face and same way so different parts them na in body. We then find out now the Kabbalah government hospital and then they wait for prosporting. Well, meanwhile, the police, they don't do some... Um, the police they don't do some arrest. We then people they are there for investigation and then do some arrest where they write some names them where they arrest. The names the way then they are then get Almami Kamara where they live in a Kamase village where then be last see with this woman here few um, hours in the morning. We now Wednesday the twenty fourth of January twenty twenty four. So then get them now in custody for more investigation, and this write up come out from the um, information officer at the Kabbalah Police Division, and name na Patrick J F Conte. We get for take with time for read this information to now for let we self not miss anything. So. We one invite the late woman in brother we we get now online for lay in talk to we for let we go get more information from her and same way she'll tell me more about this than sister we pass on. So we go get her na the line now. Welcome to the program. Um you go turn the phone, turn the phone, put on straight, sir. You they get me? If you you move, yes, you they get me? Yes, I they get you. All right. Yes, yes. Yes. Uh, welcome to the program. We go one for making you introduce yourself. Yeah. Okay. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Dulman, and this na Saiku John Barry, uh, live from the UK. All right. Um, we get this sad news about um, one woman we they see in water, and it happens for saying are you sister. Um, this is a very sad news. I'm not going to ask you how you feel because we all know how you feel. But so far, waiting at the information we will not serve as the family don't get. 
Okay, uh, thank you so much, uh, Dulman, and then and again. Well, of course, we don't need for even tell listeners them or viewers they say we are sad and then we are shocked and then we are devastated and then but uh, police they investigate the matter and we understand say some people they na custody and they help the police with the, the investigations so the latest is uh, well before we bear the body me, me small sister in uh, in cops before they go lay and to rest but you know when somebody die or when they kill somebody or when somebody die like well as a result of circumstances where people don't know which lead to the death then get for do what they call the autopsy where pathologists they go check the body for ascertain as to waiting lead to the death what you make the person die so we've been the try for get uh, the pathologists for go to kabbalah for go do this thing and then but everything has been done and then documents then don't go sign this morning at the cid and then we don't get the pathologists it all left free town as i speak so and then Mindy McKinney, then they try for go na Kabaladi for go do the autopsy so that we take it from there we get document they ascertain what in lead to the death of me small sister so the police, um, the people away they get out and call study. They don't give us any good information where you come out from them people and they. Mm, well, this now again it too early uh, because we then preoccupied like with uh, doing other thing we related to this autopsy and other thing, but they no we not get force any information we come out from them. And then also as legal, the, the again, the sensitive issues, legal issues involved in it. So we know we want for prejudice, for say other things they were not supposed to say. But what we know, say no more, the investigations, they go on. And then we are following and keenly, we follow the police, the conduct. And so far, they've been well they are on the right track so far. And then that, that's no more. We we not get any new information except that they have some people uh, in their custody who are helping the police with the investigations. Yes, the, uh, according to the police, which they write and uh, what we they hear um, from different social media, they say they see her with somebody when in the last see with that um, late woman. Eh? How the family relate to that person? Well, well, we, well, as far as I con, I, I, as far as I'm concerned, like of course, me not sabi that person the, and I know if say, uh, I know if well, we not sabi the person, and again, we don't know about anything between him and the person, but like, like actually, what the police say, now that person did the last see with him, and then that make the whole and because since the last see them two together. Pass we then go see the picking in body, then dump them somewhere after we then don't kill them. So that's the family. Which one are they look forward uh, for? Let the police them do now. The one way they take investigations. Which one are they look forward? Yeah. Uh, again, like we, like as we await for the uh, autopsy report, and then what we we they look for, and then what we they ask for. Not only the police, but by extension. The government of Sierra Leone, and then we we want justice for his sister, and then because uh, we want justice because then take away his sister, and then I I am really like my heart is so heavy, but uh, we we want justice, we want justice, we want justice, and at the same time also we want again because this. This is not to the Kabbalah or Kwene Dugu we use for no. Mm, because me born, sorry. I grew up in na, Tela, Dugu Lea, with uh, Kabbalah, they na de grow up. Then kind of brutal, then kind of pictures them who we don't see of me or small sister. Uh, we know, we know they say, you know, blunt happen, but it has been difficult for sin. But for Leiden, there is somebody get the audacity for Dwam. And then we just one for me all as quite a people especially the people that we live around that uh, Kamase area 
people and would they maybe the way they would not hear it, this tear we go hear it, they begin to cry because nobody know go through that pain the way not cry. The community people um, everybody will get information. We want for lay them cooperate with the police. Let nobody not hide. Let nobody not keep anybody. If you get information, go to the police. Give them that information. They because I tell you me one thing, Dulman. If you like who are they in the UK or you there America, when something happen, the police them first thing waiting in the stock, the community then they appeal to the people and say anybody will get useful information who na come to the police. Una talk to the police. Nothing then nothing no they do now. They know they do not anything bad. You will be protected. So we I want to use this platform and this opportunity for appeal to the people the way they come and say. The one the way they especially around that area where we've been done here is something or you know something. No sit down, you say you know they talk. No sit down, say no to your business. Today, now me and small sister, today now family. Tomorrow it could be you will see them way nobody this incident you not talk something tomorrow now you then get for kill or now you your small sister or now your relative then get for kill tomorrow so that is why we all need for come together we wanna give wanna cooperate with the police them wanna give them the information and then make we get to the bottom of it. We you know they say the family no only they seize advantage by anybody, say because you get issue with that policy, they go say that this. No. What do we want? The actual people them we do this thing. The actual people that we go kill Iba Sander Barry. The actual people that we do this heinous and barbaric acts. They are cowards. And then we want to smoke them out wherever they are. Any suicide in the suicide and hide, make who not keep them, make who bring them out, we give the police and the information, they will cooperate with the police them, yeah. we'll make who get to the bottom of it so that we go hold the actual people them, make them face justice. Yes, um, to the police, we, we they call on the people of Kwenadugu, like how you they talk them, the entire Kwenadugu and Falaba. We need for no. People they need for give information because this is not the first time it happened. Of um, recent last year, they see the um, body in that same area day. You know, they see one lady then damaging face. They're not able to recognize them. So if that they continue for happen, we na we not going to know how much body they will go lost um, because every day then they see possibly they lead on a die one. They know they know that kill them. When we go left for get some kind of sad news there in Akwenadugu because this is not a very sad news. They make people and the afraid for come in Akwenadugu and Falaba. And this is not thing will not be the happy now. So you will not say you get information. You get information where you know say you forgive the police. Then they safeguard you. They know they share your identity. Try hard and able to give the police that information they, so they go able for do the invest, investigation, simple one, where they not go ask for the police them, they are the big. So we don't want to take you time that too long. We want to tell you thank you for the part of this program. We go on for say sorry for the loss to the entire family and same way so to the people of Kwenadugu and Falaba. And uh, we will continue for give people um, any updates we will know. Okay, thank you so much, Dulman. May God bless you and then make God make justice prepare. So, I don't prepare for any um, burial, any funeral, from the outside the lady in Oste or any T way people have for no? Okay, yes. So, so like, again, uh, like I did tell you, so. Or family as, members, the family members, they were the different side because they get for see this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, what did I say? Uh, like, as I've been mean, telling you earlier on, uh, the pathologists right now, they don't, they don't pass McKinney, then they go Kabbalah, so we then go and do the uh, the examination, then don't do the report and everything. From there, now, now village to we, now we're inside in the Corsella, you know, far from, uh, not just nine miles, Seria. you know, far from or something like or Dugulea, then side in Dina Stella, so I didn't get for bed because I don't see now we then kill the picking or the from we then pull the body now to side. So we not get for this time we then do the examination. They might bury her today in uh, Nasella Day. All right, thank you very much, sir. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you so much, and then God bless you.
All right, that now Sheku John, na the the late sister and brother. We don't talk to the people of Kwena Dugu and Falaba in Sierra Leone as a whole concerning the passing of his sister. We then see Nawata a day one, and the police then they plan do investigation, and same way so the media, um, sorry, the medical people themselves they plan do their work, and we go continue for give updates where we get them, and um, same way so one for say thank you to everybody we. Then our WhatsApp group for we on ourselves they participate by anything where they come at the group and same way so everybody where they are different um, forums there. My name is Abdul Mansare from the Queen Adugu Falaba TV News. Don't forget for share and same way so like comments. Till I get another one, I want for say bye bye.